this example, I'm going to show you how to use a, create a use case diagram. And it's fairly simple. One thing to keep in mind is that there isn't one right way to create a use case diagram. When you get into the program, you can right click and on use case diagram and select new use case diagram. And once you're in here, you can start adding things to it. So I'm going to add an actor by right-clicking and selecting Add Shape, which I will call Teacher. I will add another actor, which I will call Student. And some things they will both work on. And some things only the teacher will do. So I'm going to have a use case homework which the teacher will assign and the student will do so I can associate them. Okay, and then I can add a association from the student to homework. And teachers will also create classes, I'm going to add another association. It's a little finicky. And then you can also add other use cases. So students would select a class. They could drop a class. So you're going to do homework where you create a use case diagram and each one's going to be a little bit different that's okay but I want you to follow the directions there's a sample in the book and you're just basically going to create actors and use cases and connect them together so it's a fairly simple diagram just showing what different actors can do